Okay, so um, we get a lot of requests from customers where they want to be labeling their incoming goods as they're received uh, for labeling products or shelves with uh, product descriptions and, and prices. So I uh, wanted to give you the quick example here of um, how to go ahead and get that, you know, get some labels printed with uh, sell price and sell description as well. So. Um, so what I've got shown here is just a, a purchase order, um, simple purchase order, just one item on it. Um, and if you look uh, at the editing of this item, um, we can we can pull up the item here. You'll see we have the same item shown here in the edit item screen um, in QuickBooks, and and the sales price uh, of 9.44 shown. Um, with also a special sales description which I've edited here. It, it was the same as this description but I intentionally made it a different description so that you can see that we can support the sales description which is sometimes different than the description that actually appears here on the purchase order because again they can be two different descriptions. So sales price, sales description. Um, the other thing uh, we can show is the customer's name on the label as well uh, and and a host of other fields that are in the header here so uh, if we go ahead and pull up um, so this is purchase order number 8314 um, just to kind of show how the label connector works you would type that in here press get order okay um, actually let's go ahead and do that for a purchase order of 8314 so you can see we've pulled up uh, that same item um, that we showed earlier um, for you know out of a purchase order, um, and we'll show you here how we can just generate 24 uh, labels. We'll send it to a PDF printer for now. Um, so we've got one three by two label already kind of laid out. Uh, we'll go ahead and send this to a PDF uh, rendering printer so you can kind of see it generate on the screen. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that. All right, and we'll call this Rev3 since I was working with some other examples earlier. Okay, we'll go ahead and save that. So what we did was we printed 24 labels, kind of laid out in a bartender template uh, previously that can again be used. So let's let's go ahead and open up that PDF that got generated. Okay, okay, so you can see we pulled in the customer's name, that special sales description, uh, the sell price, uh, the item in a barcode. Uh, we've been making some changes to this module, so actually it's pulling in some of the parent item information, which we've already fixed since this video was generated. But uh, so you can definitely generate, you know, labels that show the sales description. If you want to, you can show the customer name. You don't have to do that. That's again a sort of an optional thing, and the sell price. So. Um, just demonstrating again the use of purchase orders in QuickBooks for labeling your incoming goods as they come into your organization with barcode labels. Thank you.